Yo, my dudes, what's going on? David here, and welcome to another reaction. This episode, we are diving into Parks and Rec Season 2, Episode 9, called The Camel. Hopefully, you've been enjoying the series. Hopefully, you are having a wonderful day. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Head on over to Patreon for the full, uncut, unedited reactions over there. Episodes extra early over there as well. But with that being said, buckle your seatbelts. Let's ride. What's your design going to be? Tree? Joe, you work in sewage. Your department literally specializes in crap. You really want to do this? I told you before, <laughs> crap is a slang term, and I don't like that term. But at least we don't specialize in losing like you guys. Sewage, let's roll. Damn, how does sewage always get the hottest interns? Now don't worry, Tom, we got them. Yeah, hey, Ron, how about you? Need a little dog waxing? It's only five bucks, and I'll let you cut in front of this guy. What? Come on, Pete. <laughs> this is Ron Swanson we're talking about. Oh, no. I'm impressed with Andy. Pulling himself up by his bootstraps. Reminds me of me. I got my first job when I was nine, worked at a sheet metal factory. In two weeks, I was running the floor. Oh, whew. That was great. Thank you, son. No sweat. <laughs> you shouldn't let your friends cut in line. It's not good business. Oh, you know what else isn't good business? Ooh. That guy's my friend. Right. Keep it walking. I'm saying you shouldn't let your friends cut in line. All right, sorry, Kyle. Here, give me this. Next. The mural started talking, and it came alive, and it was whispering, and I couldn't hear what it was saying, so I leaned in close, and then it ate me. At one point, Gina Gershon was there. My piece is truly going to capture the spirit of Pawnee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I never understood the term elbow grease. I guess it's not really grease, just hard work. Okay. Well, since it's the parks department, I thought I would design a pretty What park are those drawings? With um, dogs playing in it. I can't really draw, so I just cut some stuff out of a magazine. It looks like something a death row convict would make in <laughs> art therapy. <laughs> Dude, I tried. And you failed. It's oh. dogs and people playing in a park. It's cute. It's okay, sweetheart. You can't make art because you are art. Wow, really good, Jerry. For my mural, I was inspired by the death of my I'm grandma. I'm impressed. You said mural. <laughs> no, I didn't. Yes, you did. You said mural. I heard it. <laughs> anyway, she. Hey, Jerry, why don't you put that mural in the men's room so people can urinate all over it? <laughs> Jerry, go to the doctor. You might have a urinary Dude, infection. Dude, lay off of Jerry. <laughs> Just wanted to show him that hurt. Mural. I have one question. Why? We need Jerry's picture back. You, get it? I don't think they really got the assignment. If we're gonna beat all the other departments, we have Jerry. to Jerry will stand the test of time. Jerry's assignment. Like Mona Lisa. Jerry's when assignment. Music squeeze. Literally, Jerry's assignment. Tune in. But there is one winner. Us. The parks department. They're, I wish they would Tom, choose the Jerry. Vote, please. One to one to one to one to one to one. Everyone we all voted, voted for, their for own? ourselves, didn't we? Yeah. Okay. Tiebreaker, Andy. <laughs> you all right up there? <laughs> what the f man? You didn't, I didn't know? I don't know what happened. Frankly. I emitted a noise. The noise was involuntary. <laughs> Sometimes a sound is just a sound, you know? Well, at least it's not a fat human hamster eating meat. You don't even work here. Okay, guys, you both have a Exactly. Point. I say that all the freaking time. Anna's trite. always here. In April, yours was hellish and might make someone vomit. Thank you. Look. It should be in between Leslie's. About those shapes. No. There's some emotional art right there. I love you, Tom, but that. it... No kid could do that. Only God could do that. Friend Anowitz, we need you for something. No, oh, we don't need Mark. so swamped here. Anne's in trouble. We think it might be pills. What? <laughs> no. That's a lie. But this is just as important. We need you to look at a piece of art. Oh, God. Look at Jerry's. What is that? Look at this Jerry's is our alone. This for the mural contest. That'll win. This is 
garbage. We've got to go back to the shapes. No, this is no. boring. We got go to go back to Jerry's. Garden. I would take the shapes over this. Hey, come me. on. I wouldn't take the shapes over anything. I take Jerry's mural over this. No, guys. Dude, this is the beast. one. Whoa. A beast. Sorry, Mark's right. This is an outrage. Jerry's mural is greatness. Neither is Ann. Pretty good. You think they're going to win? No. No. They went super patriotic. It's a classic mistake. It seems crowd pleasing, but it's still a stance. And in government, there's always someone who will oppose a stance. Us, old man feeding pigeons, no stance. Absolutely no point of view whatsoever. Jerry's picture was no everything. I haven't been Jerry's back. Jerry's mural. I wish him good luck in his business. And yes, I will absolutely <laughs> go back to get my shoes shined soon. I don't, frankly, see why this is a topic for discussion. The moan, Ron, the weird moan you made, that was super weird. You not <laughs> that? I talked about it with the lady who went after you yeah. for a half an hour. She said she thought it was an animal. Okay. It was just an odd moment. Let's just, let's just not talk about it. Ah, that's what I was trying to say. But yeah, okay. Okay, good time. Oh, that was super awkward. Well, good luck. Thanks. You think it's over? That looks really bad. Dude, Jerry's would have knocked all of these out of Go the ahead. park. What? The camel's way more fun. I want my team back. And my team made this hot, crazy camel no, mess. There's nothing Jerry so this is what in this. We're gonna submit. Even if it means we lose. Shapes are awesome, is what they are. You can't handle it. No, I actually like them. Forgive me. Is that Jackson? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Donna. Right, so it's relevant. Who is oh he carrying? My God. Jesus Greg Kinnear. You know, it looks like he's carrying Kinnear into the burning building. Oh, well, that's because he's moonwalking. <laughs> so he Yo, I didn't realize that. should be going the other way. You know, I have actual assignments that I have to finish for art school. You think Shut he cares? and do more art for me. He's going to keep screwing it up because you're going to throw him money, Tom. Racist. It's beautiful. All right. Season two, episode nine of Parks and Rec. And I thought it was all right. It was an OK episode. Nothing spectacular. Uh, you know, obviously the chemistry between the characters have gotten way better than what they were in season one. So it's still probably uh, above most of the season one episodes, but it's still probably a six, seven to me. It's not uh, mind blowing. It's not. One that I would tell somebody, hey, go go watch this episode. It's the funniest thing you've ever seen. It's just solid. It's just another, you know, it didn't really develop any stories. It was just them hanging out at the, uh, the office per usual. Uh, we'll do a quick breakthrough uh, and see what, you know, if any moments were in there that stood out to me at least. And then go from there. Uh, so basically the episode is surrounded by a mural that constantly gets vandalized because obviously it comes off as very racist and uh, it's just not a good look. Uh, so this director or whoever he is, is trying to motivate his people to come up with a mural, uh, you know, all the different departments to come up with a mural to uh, replace the one that gets vandalized all the time. Uh, they get uh, Leslie gets into a heated uh, little battle between the sewage department um, it's literally sewage, so he really ain't had no room to talk. Uh, and so basically, they're brainstorming. Sort of, Leslie's trying to motivate them to come up with this mural. Uh, you know, everyone is going to come up with their own mural and then pitch their ideas later on. Uh, all of them say that they're not artists, which is obviously clear. Uh, well, everyone. I don't think Jerry really said that he wasn't, but um, you know, Leslie makes the joke about. Uh, Donna having her nails done, but Donna's like, seriously, like, <laughs> I don't do these. I get someone else to do them. And so basically just, you know, subtle little funny joke here and there in that scene. Uh, Andy is still shoe shining, which is good. The whole Andy Ron thing was really funny. Uh, Cause first of all, Ron is so, he doesn't show a lot of emotion. So the fact that, uh, you know, he was actually into something. And then the fact that Andy has held a job this long seems like a really crazy thing as well. Uh, but basically, he's shy, he, he kicks this guy out of the seat. 
Make sure that Ron gets his shoes uh, shine first. Ron likes it a lot because I guess he's got a bunion or whatever. Uh, the sound of that sounds disgusting. The fact that it's the size of a toe sounds even worse. This guy then gets upset and says you can't really put your friends uh, before someone who's already in line. Uh, so Andy chucks the uh, briefcase. <laughs> then he brings it or he picks it up, brings it back and he chucks it the other way. So again, just little subtle, funny moments here and there. Nothing crazy uh, that I think anyone would talk about years down the road or anything like that. Uh, so obviously Tom doesn't have a artsy side to him. So he goes and uh, pays somebody to make him a, a mural. He then tells him to make it based off of him. I don't know what this is. I mean, it's abstract, I guess. That's what he said. So I don't know much about art. So I'm guessing that's what this is. I couldn't tell you what this is. Not one thing stands out besides the shapes. Uh, but basically everyone's art project really, really sucked. Like really sucked. Like nothing about any of their um, art projects besides Jerry's and even Leslie's was really all that, you know? Uh, but then basically Ron comes back for another shoe shine. Uh, he purposely scuffed his shoe just so he can get another shoe shine. Uh, just because he wanted Andy to uh, rub up on his bunion. Again, the Andy Ron stuff was good. It was good. I'll give him that. Everything else was sort of whatever though, you know what I mean? Uh, so obviously Ann's project, I don't even know why Ann is here. Can anyone explain to me why Ann just hangs out here more than she's at her own job? It just doesn't make any sense to me. But whatever, her art project stunk it up. Tom, I love you. That ain't it. Uh, I like Donna's, actually. I thought Donna's idea was really cool. The Last Supper with, you know, people from Indiana. That seems like a really good idea. <laughs> the fact that she ran out and put a NASCAR as somebody was crazy but I thought the idea behind it was really cool come on people come on can somebody else support me on this dude Jerry knocked this one out the freaking park every if you zoom in everything is a picture of someone from the from Indiana come on man give Jerry a round of applause he would have clearly won they would have changed the mural if it was this one that they showed. Uh, but basically they make fun of him because he mispr uh, mispronounced a mural. So he pretty much was just like, whatever. They, they pick on Jerry way too much. Screw you guys. I love Jerry. I don't know what the heck this is. This is just April's weirdness. Uh, and then Leslie's was just fine. I mean, I don't know if it's the perfect image to showcase but it is historical so, I mean it makes sense uh, but basically they all come to the agreement that you know with the voting system they all voted for themselves it ain't gonna work we gotta come up with something else uh, then Ron comes again for another one but then as he's you know shining his shoes he lets out this odd little moan and he gets freaked out Ron sort of walks away and tries not to make it a a real moment there. He tries to like walk away from it. Uh, but basically this is them sort of arguing over their, like their art projects, like which one's the worst one. And so then Leslie goes to Mark. Mark isn't that cool, so I don't know why they went to Mark. All right, Mark's an artist, whatever. Does the drawings, fine. Which, I mean... Marx was fine too. I just like Jerry's way more. Marx is just kind of sort of like what you see if you go to like a medical place and you know, a waiting room. And I mean, it's fine. It's relaxing. It's what he said. It would have won over the one they put, obviously. Uh, but then the sewage guy comes back. His mural looks really cool. Leslie gets nervous. Uh, the fireman one looked really lame, but it was them. And so they were proud of it. And so... Leslie obviously took it, uh, took their uh, team one in, and they lost. But nobody won. They literally kept the same mural, and 
that was that super awkward conversation between Andy and Ron here where obviously Andy felt very uh strange about the 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 moan that uh Ron let out so it was just kind of like really awkward or whatever uh let's see let's see let's see let's see then the end credit scene is just uh Tom going back and trying to get more art from the guy it was just an okay episode, man. I, I would be extremely shocked if anyone says that they were looking forward to this episode in particular or if that they were uh that they enjoyed this episode a lot. I'm not saying I didn't enjoy it. I'm just saying it it was just average. It was okay. It's definitely not my favorite. It's not my least favorite, but it's definitely not my favorite. But that's the episode. Hopefully you enjoyed the reaction. Hopefully you enjoyed the review. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Head on over to Patreon for the full uncut unedited reactions over there episodes extra early over there as well with that being said i will catch you guys later peace guys